Thanks. Um, welcome back again, everybody, to the main stage. Um, I'd now like to introduce Helen Karan from Minute University, uh, who's going to talk about business pathways and opportunities at Minute. So over to you, Helen. Thanks very much, Ray. It's great to be here today to represent Minute, and I'm just going to give you a short presentation, and would be very and would welcome your um, any questions afterwards. So can you see that? I can, yeah, just if you probably want to go into presenter mode. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. Yep. Great. Yep, all good. Lovely. So as I said, uh, it is a pleasure to join you here today to represent my, my university, Menus University. And I will talk a little bit about our business and social science programs and also give you a short introduction to the university itself. As you can see, it's a very beautiful university, uh, a very historic one. The original college dates from 1795. So we have um, two campuses, this beautiful old campus and a brand new campus adjacent about five minutes walk from this campus. Uh, just a quick word about our rankings. Um, we are currently ranked 43rd in the world as the best young universities. So while our roots are in the college um, established in 1795, Maynooth University itself was established 21 years ago as an independent National University of Ireland university. So that's why we are uh, uh, classified as a young university. And as you will see, we're 43rd in the world, 192nd in Europe. And we do particularly well in social sciences. Uh, we're in the 201 to 250 band in the THG for the social sciences. And as you will see, our School of Business ranks in the top 20% on the worldwide reach research impact as well. We're a growing university, so we're one of the fastest growing universities in the world. We're constantly developing our campus. So I mentioned that we had an old campus and a new campus. The new campus is steadily growing. This is a um, rendering of our new proposed um, student hub, which will be started in the next, week, next year. And we've just create, um, opened some new teaching buildings. And so the facilities are constantly improving at our university. Just a short word on our location. So we're just outside Dublin city centre, about 25 kilometres to the west of uh, Dublin with really good connections on by train and we're on the Dublin bus network. So we say we have the best of both worlds. We're located in a university town, very close to Dublin, the city centre and the international airport, but in a very peaceful, uh, beautiful location as well. So it's safe quiet and friendly, and yet you can very easily access Dublin for all of the facilities there. At Maynooth, we pride ourselves on our um, service to students, and our motto is students come first. So I am a representative of the international office, so we look after the students from the time they apply to the time they arrive, right through until they finish their uh, studies at Maynooth. So we would have offer holder events, pre guidance and orientation. We did social events during the year. And then we would be on hand to give you immigration advice and any other advice you need. And in addition, we have a range of student services, medical center, budgeting center, and student help desk available to all students and a great range of academic supports. So um, small tutorial groups, a math center, a writing center, and an academic advisory office. And also we would offer some pre-sessional English language classes as well. Minute is uh, renowned for its active campus life. It's a very sociable university. And in a recent poll, it was voted Ireland's friendliest university by students in Ireland. And there's lots of activities on campus. Um, and we plan to be back on campus in September. And as we will have a fair day where you will be able to meet uh, representatives of over 100 clubs and societies, all uh, activities coordinated by our students' union. Um, obviously, a very part, important part of your decision to study is your um, 
career prospects for the development after graduation. So we have a career development centre on campus. Their job is to offer a range of resources to help you in making key decisions about your career path. So uh, as part of that, we would have on-campus recruitment events, we would uh, have job listings and individual sessions with a careers advisor on developing your CV, interview preparation, etc. And we would also have self-assessment and career interest tests. In addition, we have very strong industry links and very good contacts with industry partners, for example, Intel, Hewlett Packard, IBM, PC, and Microsoft. And I'm going to talk a little bit more about this later in more depth when I go into internship and, um, and opportunities for our students on our degrees. So we have three faculties at the new, um, science and engineering, arts and philosophy, and the one I'm going to talk about today, social sciences. And as you can see, this is a range of undergraduate programs available in our social sciences faculty. Most of these programs would be three to four years in duration. The business programs in particular could be are an option of being completed within three years, or you can take an extra year to do an internship or a study abroad period. As you can see, we have a range of different subjects under our social science faculty, ranging from anthropology and criminology all the way to business, finance, law and accounting, data science, product design, and social science. Uh, just a quick word about the Department of Law, as I believe this might be of interest to a lot of you. Um, so our law graduates are very successful in the legal professions, but also in the NGO sector, in management, consulting and government and European institutions, as well as journalism and policy development and business. So the law department is particularly strong at the loop, and they offer options that are not available to other law schools, like tax law and banking and financial law. And they make moot court and legal writing an integral part of the undergraduate program. So many students have the opportunity to spend a year at a leading law Dublin firm, a sorry, Dublin law firm, or a law school in the US and Europe. And also they can, um, top students have contributed to the Irish Law Journal. So uh, students on the undergraduate law programs are uh, eligible to apply for placement opportunities. It is quite competitive, but because they are facing in particularly good uh, law um, companies, but these are options uh, for you if you decide to study law at Manu. And there are also some placement opportunities available on our postgraduate. Just going to talk a little bit there about the postgraduate programs. So as you can see, these are arranged between our School of Business, Economics Department, Geography, Law, again, Education and Design Innovation. And of course, PhD programs are available in all of these areas. Most of these programs are one year programs and level nine uh, degrees that entitle you to a two year stay back visa after graduation. I'm going to talk a little bit more about the School of Business in more depth later. So at the moment, I'm just going to highlight that in particular geography is very strong for NUC and we're particularly well known for our climate change degree and our ma a master's in geographical information systems and remote sensing. Uh, equally, we have uh, some very strong programs in law, um, an LLM in global legal studies, international business law and international justice. And these are very popular with our international students and as well a master's in comparative criminology and criminal justice. The Master's in Education is not a teaching qualification. This is actually a kind of a top of Master's for people who are interested in educational theory and educational leadership and practice, the one year program, and it's very popular with our international students at the moment. And a unique thing about Maynooth um, is that we teach product and design innovation. And again, this is a one year program in design innovation, which is very popular and um, we have many successful graduates in this program. So just a word about our School of Business. So our School of Business was set up about 10 years ago and it has grown year on year and has become very successful. And um, 
which is renowned for the industry experience of its lecturers, the real world focus of its course content and its preparation for the workforce uh, in the design of its programs. So at undergraduate level, work placement is available and the following programs are accounting and finance degree, business and accounting, business and management, entrepreneurship, finance, international finance and accounting, international business, law and accounting, law and business, and quantitative finance. So if you take one of these postgraduate programs, undergraduate programs, and then you hire them, you're entitled to apply for a work placement. And just to mention, we have a work placement office that would coordinate with you in finding your spot and preparing you for taking your work placement um, position. In our master's programs at MOVE uh, in the School of Business, the level, the, the focus is very much uh, industry engaged, uh, real world projects, learning by doing, career focus. So they would invite industry partners, some of them are listed here on, on the right hand side, to interact with students on the program to offer them real world problems, real world projects that students are invited to solve and to present. And it's very good experience in dealing with industry and in dealing with business issues uh, in the real world and uh, having an opportunity to present your findings and your, uh, your learnings to people in, uh, in business. So this is a, a unique thing that we do with Maynooth. It's very, as I said, industry engaged, really priming you and preparing you for work in, these, in, in the world of business. So these are the range of postgraduate programs available at our School of Business. Um, most of these are one-year programs, uh, with the exception we have a two-year in finance and accounting for people who do not have a finance and accounting background. But if you do have an accounting or finance background, you get to apply for the one-year program. The business management is specifically for those who do not have a business background. So you could have, say, engineering or computer science or science, and this would be very perhaps of interest to you. One of our new programs is business analytics, and this is proving really popular. Uh, we have a lot of international applications for this. So um, in our science faculty, we have data science uh, masters, and in, in business faculty, we have this, uh, this one-year business analytics program. And in addition, the international business and strategy, strategy innovation are very popular one-year programs in this area as well. Uh, just a quick word, I'm conscious of time. Um, just our, some of our graduates have some uh, excellent things to say about their time. Just Shen Yang, a recent graduate, from China, did the two-year accounting at Manute because he didn't have an accounting backward, uh, background and he really enjoyed it and did very well from it. And um, one of our students from India uh, did the Master's in Strategy and Innovation. And as you can see, enjoyed the work experience and enjoyed interacting with the students and the project work in, in particular, the, the, the real-world project work we found particularly useful. So if you're interested in this, um, just we have a taster week for the School of Business running from May 24th to the 28th. It's an online taster. You can go to our School of Business website and you will find the link. And this will give you an idea of classes and, and you can talk to lecturers and it's a really good way of getting flavor of the, of the programs. And in addition, our postgraduate office are running a road show between the 24th and the 12th, 24th of May and 12th of June. So you have an opportunity to log in there and again, see real world um, examples of classes and talk to lecturers. So I'm conscious that I may be running out of time. So I'm just gonna have a quick few slides on the rest of the services. We have on-campus accommodation, secure on-suite accommodation on our North Campus, with launch facilities and reception, and you share an apartment with other students. We also have a home finder service for people who want to find accommodation in um, Maynooth or the surrounding towns. The tuition fees just very generally there, a range depending on the type of program you do. And um, we have a, a full list of scholarships available on our international office website at partial and undergraduate and postgraduate scholarships. So in summary, um, we have amazing location close to Ireland, the capital of Ireland, and the headquarters of many multinational high-tech companies with which we have very good links. 
We're the only university in town in Ireland guaranteeing a quiet, safe and affordable environment with a broad and flexible curriculum, quality academic departments, and of course, we really pride ourselves on our student experience, the beauty of the campus, the active student life, the safe environment and unique experience. So well, thank you. Um, I think I might have come to the end of my time, but um, I'm willing to answer any questions you may have. And um, you're very welcome to get in contact with you directly or put your co comments through to DIFC, who can also contact you. Directly. That's brilliant. Thanks very much, Helen. And um, I know it was short, but, you know, mm. sometimes less is more and uh, yeah. it was quite insightful. And what we will do is... If anybody has any questions for Minute, um, please feel free to pop into their booth um, where Helen and I think Pauline might be there as well, where they can answer any questions for you um, about Minute and the programmes they have to offer. And then obviously any students who need a pathway through DIFC, we'd be happy to advise you and discuss with Minute to make sure that you, know, you can avail of those opportunities. So our next session is going to be on liberal arts uh, in just over 10 minutes time with Mary Immaculate College in Limerick. And uh, I'll see you all back on the main stage then. Thanks again, Helen. Um, Thank really you. appreciate Thanks your so time this morning. Um, and uh, we'll talk to you soon. Okay. Thanks, Ray. Thanks, Mary. Great. Bye -bye. Thanks a million. Bye-bye.